back. You see, that girl is a total disgrace to this family. Her mother never had her out of wedlock. Why would she give birth to a bastard for me in this house? Eh? My brother, hmm? wait to Kenobi. Eh? Wait to Obi, calm down. The mistake has been made a long time ago. What you should be thinking about now is how to remedy the situation. I'm not <laughs> crying over speed milk. What remedy? What remedy are you talking about? I said it before, and I will repeat it over and over. That no daughter of mine will raise a bastard in my house. My brother, brother, hmm? wait you can help me, wait you see, uh, calm down. But at least you know, this girl will not take this blame alone, no. You and I will share in taking this blame. Because we as elders sat at home, white children mistook vulture for kite. What did we do? Exactly. What did we do? Exactly my point. I am doing something now. That is why I said Nkiru will not bring that bastard, that thing into this house. Hey, 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 my husband, I greet you. Indeed. Hey. Oh. Nenna, <laughs> it's been long I saw you smiling like this. <laughs> what happened? I'm smiling and dancing because I have good news for you people. <laughs> I thought as much. So what good news? I'm just coming from the hospital now. Guess what? Ikiru has been delivered of a bouncy baby boy. Uh, <laughs> a boy? A very handsome boy for that matter. You need to see him. Hey, hey, hey. I hope she's okay. I mean, the mother. Hey, she's very okay. If you see her, you will not believe that she's the one that just put to bed now. The doctor is already thinking of discharging her later in the day. Thank you. Hey. As we are going, hey. go straight to the hospital. <laughs> and as soon as the doctor discharges her, take her along with you to your house. Huh? Yes, make sure she doesn't enter this house. Papa and Kiru. You mean you are still obsessed with that girl after all this? Why wouldn't, be as, uh, why, why wouldn't I be upset? Eh? Let me ask you, how many children did you bear for your father before you get married? Eh? I was coming away. I was coming away. Nana, go. Nana. Please, you can go. Thank you for the message. You shall make that Thank you very much. Look at, look at the person you are interceding for. Look at her eyes. Look at her eyes. Can you see any, 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 you have scolded this child enough. This is time for you to comfort her. Comfort who? Look at Comfort who? I have not started scolding her. This is just pampering that I'm doing. Maybe you didn't hear me when I said that I will never, never, I want to break my neck that receive this, this, this idiot and that Omali into this house. My house. What signal is this, eh? Papa and Kiru, what is wrong with you? How can you be so wicked to your own daughter like this? If her mother were to be alive, will you do all these things to her? Will you? Where do you want her to take this child to? Where do you want her in this village to take this baby to? Nena, if you talk to me in that manner again, I will do away with the fact that you are a married woman and give you the discipline you never had from your parents. What stops you from taking her to your husband's house? Or don't you have no any accommodation? Can you imagine? Eh? What am I even worrying myself over for? Eh? I've played my own part in you. If he lies, let him take you aside. If he lies, let him drop you aside. Me, I don't care anymore. I am going. Go. Go and don't come, don't come back. Eh, uh, I will go. Go. I will go. Hey, how are you going, okay? This place. Come on, Ada, let me see you. Yeah, but if you pull him out, come on, 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 are you claiming this house to be your own? Uh -uh. This I house. I am claiming it for you. Remember, let me tell you. Papa built this house. 
Papa built this house. Our father built this house. And the girl here is Papa's granddaughter. So she has equal right as you do in this house. Onye Nkuzi. What's wrong with you? No, 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 Hey, you have to go back to the church. I know your father acted in anger and wronged you. Eh? You have to go back, please. Forgive and forget, no matter what. He has been pleading and pleading and begging that you should forgive him. Eh? Please forgive him, no matter what. If not for any other thing, for the sake of that child, please. Everybody in this village thanked me and every child because I had an unwanted pregnancy. Nobody would let me into their house. Nobody cared for my new baby. Not even my father would let me into his house. I understand. You have to forget about it and concentrate on how to raise your child. Eh? But you have to go back to it. My dead body, that was the house. Hey, Nkiru, don't talk like your father. Don't utter words that you will regret in the future. Who told you I will regret? I will not regret anything more. Who told you I cannot raise this boy here? Yes. Yes. I will raise him here. Mama, mommy, I hope you took the biscuit I kept for you in the cupboard. You didn't. I hope to go hungry. Mm -hmm. Be a good boy, okay? Mama, eh? Oh. Is it okay? Thank you. Oh? Are you ready to go now? Yes, yeah, so I'm ready to go. Eh? Your food is inside. Okay. Eh, nah. okay. You're doing well. Thank you. Eh? At least we'll have enough uh, firewood for a uh, care market uh. in the next two days. Of course, Mama. Eh? <laughs> Can you so what you're, uh, Mama? Eh, um, remember to stop by the clinic on your way and buy your drugs. Remember what the doctor said about your health. Yeah, but I know, but I don't think I will have enough money to buy the drugs. By the time I pay my dues at the, the Umwada meeting, I'm not sure I'll have up to 100 naira left in my bank. Mami Jakwa, you can pay the dues later now and buy the drugs first. Your life is more important to us than anything. Yeah, it's your cookie, but I've owed this due for a long time. But by the time, you see, all that firewood you packed at the back, hey, by the time we are done with selling them, we will have enough money to buy the drugs. <sighs> oh, Nam. Mm -hmm. That means I have to uh, break more firewood now, so we'll have more to sell.
Chimeke? Chimobi? Ne. Organize? This is too much now. <laughs> I'm not complaining now. It's Yoku. But I went to your house and I saw heaps and heaps of firewood. You have enough for a chemical now, so why are you suffering yourself like this? And who told you that what I have is enough? Hey, 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 Say it, woman, what is the problem? Your mother. Your mother. What happened to my mother? What? She had an attack at the meeting. Chimo! Hell! And her drugs are finished. Yeah. Chimo! Where is she? Where? She's at the village square. allow your mother to run out of drugs. How many times? Doctor, I am very, very sorry. I admit, I must admit, this one is my fault. Please, I'm sorry. It will never happen again, Doctor. Please. Please. You should be grateful to your God that you rushed her to the hospital at once. Maybe by now you will be... Bam, 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 Doctor, you can't count. Nothing is going to happen to my mother at all. Even God in heaven and all the angels know that nothing will happen to my mother. Then you have to play your part and let God play his own part. I've heard you, Doctor. I'll play my own part. And thank you very much for saving her life. Go and see her. Thank you, Doctor. Hey, well, how is she? How is she? Oh, how is she? She's fine now. Hey! She's under control. Thank God. Thank God. See, I have not been myself since I heard the news. Thank God, though. I was just coming to your house to call you. Oh. Mm. Anyway, she's fine. Uh, she's sleeping now. The doctor said I should go get food for her that she can eat when she wakes up. What would you want me to cook for her? Maybe her favorite. Come, let's go to the house and cook now. Come. No. Okay. What a bear. You don't get the point. What point? I don't have any money left on me. And we don't even have any food stuff in the house. It's okay. I wasn't even telling you to go to your house. Come, let's go to mine and cook. Eh? Come, let's go. Well, go to your father. I hope he's not around. So fast. Uh -uh. Don't you know that anything that affects you affects me? Eh? Nah. <laughs> no, Mamu. You've done so much for my mother and I, you. I don't even know how I can repay you. <laughs> Stop saying that. Everything I do, I do for love. Hmm? I don't think I can ever love anybody like I love you. And I always like to see you happy. <laughs> hey. Jesus, your father. Mm -hmm. Is that why you're shaking? Are you not a man? Are you not a man? See, stop shaking no. Just stand straight and walk bold like the man that you are. Never now take this. Take 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 it to the hospital. Eh? Later in the night I'll come and see how you and mama do. You know go? Okay. 
I don't know why this life is such a mystery. How do you make that a popular saying that the rich man said to the poor man's son? I wish I had a son like you. Why the poor man's son said to the rich man's son, I wish I had a father like yours? <laughs> Who are you referring to in this contest? Chimobi, of course. Such a handsome, intelligent boy, but has no father. No identity, a bastard. Huh. But his position does not affect him in any way, or does it? Of course it does. Which father in his right senses will give out his daughter's hand to a boy like that? My dear, forget about Okoye's attitude. Not even my own father will behave like him. You are just guessing. I'm not guessing. I'm not. I'm very sure my own father will not behave like Norma's. Come on, let's go. Bye bye. Who is there? Korea Bound. She will be walking around. What are you doing here this evening? I came to check on you now. I heard what happened to your mother. My mother is fine. Thank you for checking on me. Mm -hmm. eh? uh, please go before Norma will see you here. She will be, but I saw her going out now. So what? What if she decides to come back and check on me? Then I want to be Come and go home, please. Go to your mother's house. Eh? Ada, thanks for coming. My mother is very fine. She's fine. Thank you, Ada. Brother Noah. Danawa, thanks. I'm going. Go. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming. I'm going. Bye bye. Good night. I'm going. Ada, go now. Thank you very much. Thank you. Ha. Where is Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 What are you talking about? The way Norma does things these days. She's always with Chimobi, morning, afternoon, and night. How about? Because it's not you. It's now too much, Adi. How do you mean? Hmm. You think I don't know? Hmm. I know everything. Every, every. What are you talking about? I know you admire Chimobi a lot. And you wish you could even take him away from Norma. Is that right? Oh, <laughs> I think I did not see you. I saw you last night. I saw you. I I only went to see how his mother was faring. Mm. That's all. There's nobody this small day here. Eh? I don't know what is wrong with you. I'm your friend. Open up. Tell me. Not that I don't have any other trade. All we are asking for here is just 
a small piece of land for for their life to farm on. Instead of paying them to some money to farm on his own land, if you give us a piece of land, then we'll be able to farm and we eat from it. We don't have to go to the market all the time buying food stuff. We can at least get yam from our land. Or say, or we go do go. Eh, do something. Because yam, oh, I'm not going to get here. Well, thank you. What you are asking for is a very hard thing. When your father, our elder brother, was alive, he kept on insisting that he must not raise a pastor in his house. I never saw reasons for him there. But now, I understand better. Now, my little advice to you is take some money, go and look for his father. Maybe he will still accept you back. I believe it. They will be having a piece of land for him there. As for here, nothing for him. Can anyone let me look at phone for me? You could put you just I had you. I'm not deaf. In fact, it's high time we stop eating a bad dish. Let's say the truth. Sister, I am surprised at you. You know we don't have enough land. Uncle has three sons. AGK, four sons. Eh? My father had me with my two younger ones. You know we don't have enough land. Let alone giving out land to strangers. Strangers. Ekene. Ekene. stranger. Ekene, it's me, Kiru, your sister. Kibolo stranger. Let's go. Okay? We'll survive the world. We'll survive it. I know. Let's go. You call your sister a stranger in my own father's land. I'll keep it up. If I were you, I would go back to the man who got me pregnant. Oh. I believe they'll be having a portion of the land for him there. You know, in our culture, women do not inherit land. I don't know. I'm going to go back to Uncle, remember. There is God and He's watching all of us. There is God and He's watching you people. Nothing, I'm fine. No, you are not. I'm not fine. I said I'm fine. Why are you doing this to me? Chimobi, you're beginning to lie to me. Me, Norma. I don't know. It's not fair. It's not fair. Okay, tell me, what is it? Okay, okay. There's something bothering me. There's something wrong, but... I want to keep it to myself. I don't want to discuss it with anybody. Oh, Charu, Charu, Charu. Now I'm anybody. I'm anybody, Okuya. This is what I've been saying. It's like in this relationship, I'm the one that has more love. Eh? Look at you, hiding something from me. When we're supposed to be sharing our pain, our sorrow, just the way we share our love and our joy. If you name now or them, is it fair? It's not fair, is it? It's the same thing I've been talking about. It's that same thing that has been bothering me. My mother's people have refused to give us any portion of land. None. And the thing is seriously disturbing my mother. Oh, Hi. Honestly, eh? I, I just don't get why some people are so inconsiderate. Why, they not, why don't they want to help your mother? Their sister. Their own blood. Oh, no, man, no, no. The one that is paining me the most is that my mother has refused to tell me my paternity. Not to me, not to anybody. What kind of thing is that now? So, is she now the Holy Mary, the Mother of God that was conceived by the Holy Spirit? It's okay. Hmm? It's okay. I'm very sure that she will at her own time. When is her own time? When? I don't know. But I know she'll tell you. Hmm? Listen. I don't want this to bother you at all. If nobody accepts you the way you are, I do. I don't care where you come from. I don't care who your father is. All I care is about you and the fact that I love you very much. That is all that matters. Okay? Hmm? 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 
I've been thinking. I, I want you to go to the city. Yes. You know, deep down within me, I know that the God I worship would establish you in the city. That way, these your uncles won't treat you the way they are, they are treating you. Once you become rich, I can bet you, they will all begin to respect you and life will be different. Mama, if I go to the city, who will I leave you for? Is it me you're thinking about or is it a normal? Mama. <laughs> Don't worry about me. I can take care of myself. I know you're important in our house. You know you're my priority, Mama. You are my main priority. Your health condition is not stable. And the people in this village, they hate you, Mama. They hate us. And the only way we can survive and make it is by sticking together, by taking care of each other. Okay, let's say I leave you and go to the village now. If something happens to you, God forbid, I won't forgive myself. I'll just close my eyes and I'll die. Oh, what if I get mem? Nothing would happen to me. I am strong. I can take care of myself. Look, Mom, the dream I have for you, it, it, it's a bigger one. I don't want you to end up wasting here in the village. Pico, eh? Anugum, if I'm going to the city, then I will take you with me. If you can find out somehow, you know I'm not young anymore, eh? And I am not too old not to take care of myself. I am strong and I can take care of myself. Oh na. You know. Okay, mama. But this is not what we should be discussing right now. Eh. Uh, so what should we be discussing? That thing that you're hiding from me and from everyone else. And what is that? Mama, who is my father? Mama, tell me, I need to know. Is he alive? Is he still alive? Where does he live? Where is he? Mama, please tell me now, I need to know. Stop keeping it away from me. Mama. Object of interest. You are object of interest. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we we'll see that first now. Uh, <laughs> That's no problem. Huh? Uh, She's here for you. Uh, She's in there. Uh, She's in there. Wow, wow. I can't wait to see her. I can't really wait to see her. Uh, you know, my father has told me so much about her. Oh. Yeah, I can't really wait. <laughs> you see, but I'm sure you have seen her. Yeah, of course, yeah. because I've seen her, I've seen her picture. She's quite beautiful in the picture. But you know, I'm no more in the States now. And I'm right here in Nigeria now. And so I want to see my wife. Even though that I got a power to be out of the way. I see that woman. Yeah. Let me call my wife. Oh you do ya. 
Oyiridia. If you go, man. Our in-laws. You're welcome, Bichu. No, no. Look, Hey, look, 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 let me go and call her to come and greet you. Yes, ma'am. Hey! No, no! 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 And I, I, I was calling you. Your father wants you to come and greet Nelson and his people. Hmm? Onye? Mama, I told you. I told you and I told Papa. I'm not interested in that marriage, Joe. I told you people. Shut up! Shut your mouth or I'll shut it for you with a hot slap. I am not interested in that marriage. My friend, go out there and go and greet them or say something. I'm not going anywhere. I won't go. You say you're not going anywhere. You better go out there, take an effort. I'm not going anywhere, oh, Mama. In fact, eh, nothing will take me out of this place. I'm not going. No, Ma. Don't let your father hear this. Or you want me to go and call your father? And where You're not going, Ekwa. You're not going. Can you pause them now? Listen to me, woman. You are your daughter. You are joking. You better go and look for her wherever she is and bring her back to this house so I should come and greet my in-laws. Why can't you see she has run out of the house? No, ma. She has run out of the house now. I have spoken. No. No, ma. No, no. I'm not going to I made it lost. I am sorry for taking much of your time. Your object of interest was simply It shows that she went to collect the things from her wife. Collect what? I don't understand you. You just told us a while ago that she was in there. What the fuck is going on? That was what I thought then. Until my wife came to inform me that uh, look at the present situation. <laughs> Wait a minute. Are you trying to tell me that she's not aware of her coming today? Is that what you're saying? Ma, ma, ma. She's fully aware. Huh? <laughs> but she, you know, but what? What other fucking appointment is more important than today? Tell me. Yeah. By the law. Please don't be about me. Huh? You know the children of nowadays. Sometimes they can be silly. Huh? This is bullshit. Fucking bullshit. I can't believe this. Nelson, calm down. Uh, let the patient to finish. The patient does this, the start a story. Thank you. That's good. 
This is ridiculous. This is fucking uncalled for. How can I sit my fucking ass here for over an hour waiting for her? Man, I can't take this shit. I shouldn't. Don't misunderstand. It's not intentional. Huh? I don't understand. What, what exactly do you want me to understand? What do you want me to understand? Mm. Tell me that this is the handwork of the devil. Bullshit. Fucking bullshit. Okoye. Okoye. Listen now. Tell me the truth. What is the problem? Listen now. Is it not this Obanje? This Mami Owata of a, a, a girl called my daughter, Noma. I told her that her sister will be coming here today. Huh? But she. Noma. Bullshit. Noma, I am important. Daddy, let's go. I can't take this shit anymore. You could uh, understand me. Okay. To whom much is given, much is expected. Good. Huh? But please, we will go. But Mas, how can I move? Jeep, you go. Please, please, please. I'm going to go. Are you sure they're still there? Maybe they've gone. I don't care. I don't care. If they like, let them stay. If they like, let them go. All I know is that they will stay there till thy kingdom come. Because I'm not planning to enter that house till night fall. No. I'm not entering there. You know, this issue will cause a lot of problems. It will raise a lot of dust. Why are you talking like that? You're talking as if you don't know. I'm sure your father has been collecting money and other gift items from this guy's father through him. And he must have given an impression that you're already there. Oh, but wait, is that young man a fool? How can you be giving uh, give I, I have items to my father? And then you have not even bothered to buy a common phone for the girl in question so that at least you can be talking. How can you be spending money on a girl you have only seen in pictures? A girl you have not even heard her voice for once in your life. In fact, it doesn't make sense to me. It I is swear. possible. Ne? It is very, very possible. Look, eh? it's possible because he feels he's based in the US. Hmm. They feel that our girls over here would do anything to marry a foreign based husband. Oh, I'm sure he has not even lost any doubt about this issue. Well, it is a pity because he just met a different girl. Okay? I go where my heart leads. I follow my heartbeat. I, I, I go for love, not wealth. <laughs> See? You are all that I need. Hmm? I don't need anyone else. My love. <laughs> I know. <laughs> hey, <the best. laughs> don't don't even try it. No me temo. Right. So they've gone. You allowed your daughter to sneak out of this house, knowing fully well that Nelson and his father will be here. Nani, how can you talk like that? I didn't know she was going to sneak out of the house. That shameless girl has to actually drop this level, high level of embarrassment to me because of that bastard. Eh? A boy who has no identity at all, a boy who has no single case man. A boy who's mother caught by sleeping around with men, eh? Because of him, my own daughter, 
no man. Now want to deprive me of being an in law to, to the Nelson, who is from a very worthy and respected family. But you dear, it will not happen in this household. At all. At all, it will never happen. I will personally kill her and kill her bastard. So anytime I see him, I will kill him. You better go and wonder. Because anywhere I see, anytime, any other time I see that, that he goes, anywhere around my compound, I will personally kill him. Kill. I will shoot him and wait for the consequences. Okay. Hey. No sense. No ma. No ma. Yeah. Hey. I will shoot him and face the consequences. No sense. What you want? You want me to come in there and sleep over this thing so that by tomorrow morning my full anger will have subsided. Huh? But I will not do that. I will wait till she calls you. Are you going to fall? Ah, hold it. I want to be left alone. Just make sure that all the backyard doors are locked. Do not allow this girl to sneak into this house without my consent. I have locked all the doors. Done your part very well. When I go to bed, how uh, I many if you have to sleep? Huh? For me, I will wait here until she calls home because I know she will not sleep outside the bed. What if she decides to? Woman, go to bed. That's it. Tabago. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Well, what do you presume? I'm a new chair, dear. 
<laughs> now, hmm? you have to listen to what I'm telling you. There is nothing in this village. I'm not afraid there. I need you to go to the city where there are lots of opportunities. Hopefully, one good opportunity will come your way. Then you come back. All these your uncles and relations will, will look up to you. You will not become a part of them. That is what I want for you. Mama, it's not, it's not as if there's anything too special in this village that is keeping me here. It's just you. Ah. Yes, Mama, if I leave you here, who will take care of you? no. Look at me here. I, single-handedly, brought you up in this heart. I am still strong. I will take care of myself. It's not the same thing. You're no longer that young now. You know that. Yeah? Hey man. And your health condition is not stable. It would be too risky for me to leave you all by yourself. Like this, my father. Your father beat you up like this. Where was your mother when he was beating you? Now you mean your father did this to you? I was still in bed, and then he sneaked into the room, locked the door, and started flogging me with koboko. Was your mother? Wasn't your mother there when he did this to you? It's okay, my love. It's okay. I, I don't want it's to okay. go back to okay, my love. No, 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 you won't go back. You come and walk out. What did you do to deserve this pity? Mm, yes. Mama, I'll bring you a cup of tea. Come inside. Come, come, come. Come, come, come. Sorry. Yeah, sorry, sorry. Hey! Sorry, sorry. Mama! Mama! What is it, Mama? Yes, bring her out. Okoye, you should be ashamed of yourself. Why would you be that girl like that? It's you, Do you want to kill her? Bring her, my daughter! You're asking me. You know the best thing for you. Eh? The best thing for you now is you know what? Stay out of this matter. Mm. <laughs> Your useless son. My own son? A common bastard of no reputation. Wants to ruin my only daughter. And you want me to just keep quiet and fold my arms and watch it happen? Impossible. Oh, this is what it is all about, okay? Oh, no, I'll be okay? Oh. You are doing as if you don't know before. Huh? Pretender. Shameless fool. Get into that, that, that your cost heart of yours and bring her my daughter. Weak! You're weak. not you're not ashamed of yourself. Oh no, no, why bully bully bring? You talk like a woman. Like a common woman in the market. Truth! Yes, you could have huh? But is it not better than a woman who spreads her legs to virtually every dick and hurry and raises the generation of bastards? Huh? Oh, you want my daughter to marry? Compound bastard who has no father, no identity, no his men, nothing, nowhere. What? What am I like? Go in and bring her out, idiot. Bring her out, idiot. You will think I have your time. Don't do that and wait for my own. Come on, come on. 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 Come on, Shameless prostitute. Akura, akura. Yes, but you're always looking at me, oh. I see the way you look at me. Oh, when I pass, the way you look at my backside, I see if you're not there, may. If you're not there, may. Jebe, I don't want to No, 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 no,
see what I told you. You see what I told you, but you will not listen. Mama, it's okay. It's okay. Chimobim, it is not okay. It is just not okay. It can only be okay when you go to the city and make money. It will only be okay when you build your own house. It will only be okay when you get us out of this shame of heart. That is when it will be okay. Okay. It's okay, Mama. I've heard you. Stop shouting, okay? I'll go to the city. I will. I'll leave this village. And I promise you, I will make so much money. I will make so much money to wipe away your tears, Mama. I promise you. Please. Eh? Calm down. Stop shouting. Now, I've made up my mind to go to the city. So you want to leave me? You want to abandon me here after everything I sacrificed for you? I'm not leaving forever. I'm just changing location temporarily to help us, to make money for us. Money? Am I complaining? Huh? I don't need your money. You are all that I need. I'm tired of saying this to you. I'm tired. I know. But you don't get it, do you? You don't. I need to go so that I can upgrade my life. I need to upgrade your life. I need to make money. I need to go out there and make money. So that when I come back here, your father and the rest of the villagers will place a value on my life. Place a value on me. They will respect me. I need to go to the city so that when I come back with a jeep, a big jeep, the father will give his consent to our union. Eh? Ne. So, how am I sure that if you leave this village, you will not find another woman? And how are you sure that if you leave me here for a very long time, that our love will still be strong? How can you be sure? Our love will always be strong. Always. You've done so much for me and for my mother. You've sacrificed so much for my family. You know, the only thing that can take me away from you is death. Um, time and distance. They cannot even cover up the stamp that you've left in my heart. It's not possible. Where do I start from? Is it the uh, financial sacrifice? Is it your energy, your time that you've put in? Or is it the men, the numerous rich men that you've turned down their proposals just because of me? I'm not that happy. It's easy for you to say now. But change, they say, is the only constant thing. Who knows? You never can tell. So you don't trust me? It's not as if I don't trust you. It's just that I'm not comfortable with you leaving this village. That's all. I'll be willing to do anything you want just to prove to you that I'll never leave you no matter the situation. Anything? Anything. Oats? Blood covenant? Anything. Anything. Amuti, <laughs> what is it? Of all the girls in this village, Timo be chosen one. It is called love. L O V E. Love. Akoko. Two or one say. Hey. I sense jealousy here. Who's your own? Jealous of who? Norma. Why would I be jealous of a Norma? Over that bastard. Hey, then mind your own business. Let them be. I'm not after what they do. Mm -hmm. All I'm saying is that Chimobi is too handsome for Norma. Oh, Norma herself is also beautiful. Mm -hmm. So let them be. Is she more beautiful than I am? In Chimobi's eyes, yes, she is. So put your eyes off their relationship, oh? 
wait, wait, John. Don't be talking to normal, normal, normal. Please, normal, sir. Wait for me now. Open the gates now. Uh, ma Madam, please, sorry. There's something I've been meaning to tell you. <sighs> money again? No, 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 Madam. It's not, it's not money. It's not money. What is it? Uh, please, uh, don't be annoyed. No, there's, uh, there's this my brother in the village. Yeah. His mother has been begging me to allow him to come to the city. And he doesn't know anybody. He just needs a place to stay. Uh, he will be staying with me in my quarters, madam. He will bring it to Please, I don't know what to do. So you want to bring in people to my compound where you know I detest crowd? Hey, madam, no, 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 he's not people. He's just one person, just one person. Uh, and he's my brother. Please, he will just come in the night, he will sleep, and then in the morning he will go to work. Please, he won't give any trouble, madam. Please. Just, just open the gate, eh? Open the gate. Uh, I'll listen to you when I come back, okay? <laughs> thank you, madam. <laughs> madam, thank you. Thank you. I wouldn't want anybody to disgrace me in that house. I don't want. I tell them. Nobody is going to disgrace you. Go to the city and stay with uh, Madoka. He is a good person. And I know he will take very good care of you. The same Madoka is the one that told us that his organ has not given his consent for me to come. Now, stop making excuses. Oginedo, go to the city and, and, and do something with your life. Oh, no, no, reasons why you can't go. Eh, nothing will happen to me. It's okay. I'm going to go to Then when the ogre throws me out of the house, I'll not start loitering the streets, okay? Eh, uh eh. -huh. What is wrong with that? Are you not a man? Anywhere you find yourself, you should try and survive. Look, I, I was 23 years old when I had you, and my father threw me out. But I survived with you. Wrong or didn't ya? He went to era. So, if you go to the city and they throw you out, nah, every, anywhere you find yourself, survivor. Obluba Rio Papa. It shall be well with you. Amen. Hmm? You will go in peace and come back in peace. Amen. The Lord will guide you. Eh? Amen. You shall conquer. You will find favor in the sight of men. They will help you to grow. And you will grow so big that by the time you come back to this village, you will be the richest and the greatest. Amen. 
the Lord will be with you. Okay, do give you a gen do not an udo. Oh na, makani boezi bongwa. Enugo. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Na kuni. Mama, thank you. Thank you. Hengwa. Jebe o. Jebe jebe. You'll be okay. I'll be fine. I am a strong woman. Yes, you are. Yes. Gwajebe, boss, I'm a rapper. You go. He shot at me. Eh? He tried to kill me. Hey, so that gunshot I heard was meant for you. Hey, Mama. I would have been a dead man by now. Hey. 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 Mama. Mama, your father wants to kill my son for me, okay? Mama, come back here. Mama, come here. Mama, come here. He should be the one to thank his God because he was fast enough to escape. Eh? I should have called him down. Eh? Yes. If you shoot my son, you will give birth to his son today. And you will make sure that child gets to the level where my son is today. If I kill him, nothing will happen. Eh? Who will ask of you? Is it you? If you come, I will kill you and add it up to me. Listen to me, he's a bastard though. He's a bastard. Don't you get it? Eh? One thing. 
Both of you should be careful. Let me tell you, let me tell you, he's a bastard, yes. But at least I'm his mother, and I know where he's coming from. Managewa, without Teleninti, they go out You will not a that cannot function. Malfunction Teleninti, I know you. Ineko, if you know you are keep away from my family, yo. This is the last time I will warn you. You think we don't know? Teleninti, man. Warn him, never to shut his feet in this compound again. Because the next time I see him in this compound, I will surely shoot him dead. And nothing will happen. Nobody will ask of him. He's a bastard. That's not his man. Not him. <laughs> Look at that. You are ready. What did you say? Finally, Timobi is leaving the village for the city. I saw him at the village garage. He told me he's going to Abuja now to sleep. Hey, yeah. Uh, that would be nice. Let him go to the city to better his life. You don't even get the point. What point? Norma, how is she? Uh, 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 uh. Is she the only one here? You are her rival now. Both of you are going to miss him. Hmm? I don't know why you like to talk like this sometimes. Why don't you admit for once that you love him? You think I don't know? I know, I know every every. <laughs> Give me that one. Good afternoon. Um, please, I'm looking for my brother who stays at this address. Your brother? Yes, his name is Madoka. Oh, I see. Beautiful. Uh -huh. uh, you can keep your bag over there. Here. Ah, uh, yes, yes. So, uh, so at least we can now go and see my madam. Let me introduce you to her. Tell her that you've come. Your madam? Who is your madam? Uh, you just saw her outside now. The lady you saw outside. The girl I met outside. Okay, her, oga, her father is your boss. Your oga. Father. She is my oga. She owns this house. 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 
Hey, I told you. So, so now I'm going to go to the house. Yes. I'm going to go to the house. Yes. Okay. 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 Alright, that's fine. I'll tell you what, I'll call you back in 30 minutes, okay? Yes. Okay. Alright, bye. Uh, Madam, uh, this is that my brother, the one I told you that will come from the village. Um, his name is uh, Chimbo. Good day, ma. Was we greeted before? Uh, okay, that's uh, yes, ma. How are you? I'm very fine, ma. Anyway, I'm a very simple lady. What I hate is crowd. I do not want to see anybody except the two of you in this compound. Do you find anybody else? You both will certainly leave my house. Uh, uh, Madam, uh, you know me now. I, I don't do that kind of nonsense. And uh, Chimobi, he's just coming straight from the village. He doesn't know anybody in this city yet, except me. Yes, ma, it, it's true. I, I don't know anybody in this city. Only my brother, Madam. Okay. 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 Can I uh, what? How can a lady have this kind of money? I mean, <laughs> how? Connections, connections. You see that girl? That my madam. Her father was a one-time inspector general of the Nigerian police force. As you see her, every member of her family her parents, so her brothers and sisters, they are all living abroad. She's the only one that's staying in Nigeria. Mm. Yes. You see that girl? Ah, she has access to Asoro, that seat of presidency. She can go in there and come out as if she's going to Lagos. Hmm. Well, <laughs> that means uh, me and you are still very far, my brother. Hmm. Very far. That is it. See? It is not all this buying and selling business, all this importation that our people do. There's no money there. The real money is in government. They back here, we go to Abumbi. Big money. That is what I'm aiming for. You? Yes. Aiming for? <laughs> you? Are you a graduate? Do you have to be a graduate to go into politics? After all, I have my SSC. Uh, so do I. <laughs> Leave me, Joe. Have a gala hola. Mikwe, <laughs> has, uh, has my mother called since that time? She has not called. Can we please call her? You know, she might be there right now, waiting for us to call. Chimo, how many times do you want me to call them? You were here when I called them, and they said that once your mother comes there, they will flash me and I'll call them back. They've not flashed. See, once I make money, the first thing I buy for my mother is a phone, so that I can reach her anytime, any day. This thing is becoming frustrating because uh, you have to work hard. I always work hard. 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 What job I'll start with now because I don't want to idle away my time here. You will not be idle. Mm -hmm. There are many polluting factories and bakeries in this area. Yeah. Once you go there, they will employ you. How can you go? Go now. I don't mind any of them as long as money starts flowing into my pocket as soon as possible. Don't worry. Okay, may go. Money will come. Mm -hmm. Once Madame leaves. I will personally take you to one of those places and they will give you a job. Okay. 
Has Mama called since that time? Yeah. Yeah, Chimobi. You are no longer your mother's pet. Look, you are now a big boy. A hustler in the jungle. Look, so stop all this, my mother this, my mother that. Biko. Now tell me what is wrong with me speaking to my mother and letting her know that her son arrived safely. And also to find out how she's doing. Your mother is doing well. What if you name She's okay. Huh? Biko. Uh, uh, um, See, I want you to help me wash the cars. Let me go and cut the flowers. So finish up quickly. Mm, we'll do that now. Mama, so you're still like this? Mama, welcome. Hey, Jesus. Mama, get up, get up, get up. I have to take you to the hospital. Mama, Mama, there won't be need for that. I'll be fine. What do you mean there won't be need for that? Your body temperature is rising so high. You're telling me you'll be fine. Because you ever believe? Mama, believe me. I'll be fine. I just took drugs. I'll be okay. Hey! Are you sure? Yes, Mama, yeah, baby. Hey, hurry the fuck up. Eh? Mama, get up. Go inside and sleep. This place is too open. Be near. Get out of here. Hmm? What is holding? Look at Bruce Yen again. Hey. I really can't even talk like Running temperature. Since when? For the past two days. Eh? Since Jim Obi left this village, my daughter has been running temperature. I don't know what that boy has done to my daughter. I've not seen this kind of flow, but Well, that is by the way. My in-laws will be coming to this house in the next two days. Just go in there and talk to your daughter. Eh? Let it not be like the other day. Uh, Nelson and his father is in there, visited. They left there with anger, and since then, they have refused to pick my cause. Huh? Go and talk to her. But man, can't you see that all the marriage proposals you've been arranging for her have been failing? Can't you see it? Let's allow her bring in the man that wants to marry her by herself. Ah. Hmm? So, I should then allow her to bring in that useless, hopeless, bastard of no reputation. Into my house. I'm not talking huh? about Chimobi. I'm not talking about Chimobi. Let's allow her daughter bring in her suitor. All the marriage plans you've been making for her failed. Can't you learn from your mistakes? Yes, the past effort failed. 
They all failed because that boy was a major distraction. But now that the boy is not in picture now, eh, this one will work. Or don't you think so? Eh? Go in there and talk to her. You are saying Kaine Benaya, no? You know Benaya. Eh? Do you think it will, it will not work? I didn't say that. No, I think. Mm. Uh. Mm. No. Mm. There is this other young man that wants to marry you. Huh? They said he based in Abuja. Your father's friend, Mazio Koro, brought him to your father. Yeah. He saw your picture. Also not joining you. He's coming in the next two days to ask for your hand in marriage. But I had, he had a lot of money. Eh, Cheru, Mama. Why does Papa want to sell me off like a commodity? Why? He keeps showing my pictures to everybody he sees. Or the ma. Eh? Why? Is he the one to find a husband for me? Or am I the one to show him whom I want to marry? I told him. It hasn't been up to two weeks that Nelson and his people left this place and he already uh, has another person for me. Okay, so yeah, man. Here. Oh, Mama, oh, 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 Papa, oh, 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 Your father loves you so much. Eh? You know you're very beautiful. He wants the best for you. He just wants you to be comfortable in your husband's house. Oh, what's Papa does not love me. Leave that thing. Papa does not have my interest at heart. He's not looking out for my interest. He's only trying to fill his pocket with me on what he falls up. Because if he cares about my well-being and about my interest, he will allow me to marry the man I love. Chimobi. Love and Love Chimobi. Love and Mama. Don't mama me. Akpanam. Your husband people are coming here in the next two days. Better get ready for them. Maybe I would like to spend this summer in London. If that's what you want, there's no problem. We can start making plans for it. My problem is I don't know your plans and engagements this period. Hmm. I don't think I have any serious program for now. Oh, ah, uh, uh, it's okay. We'll spare the party. Uh, but that's okay. Uh, we can take up nearly after the party. So, when is that leave the party? I think in... What? Good afternoon, ma'am. Good afternoon, ma'am. I'm, I'm sorry for interrupting you, ma'am. What is it? I came back and uh, Maduka said you were looking for me, so I came to find out. Oh, that. Yes, I wanted you to buy me something from the supermarket, but you were not there. Oh, okay. I'm here now, ma'am. Let me go and buy it. That's okay. I've uh, started it. Okay. I'll be in the room if you need me. Yes, so uh, in two days, we'll be you like him? Oh, please. I mean, who is that guy and what planet is he from? <laughs> well, the guy is kind of cute, but... But what? Bro. He's more or less my houseboy. Are you serious? Like, are you serious? Are you blind? Can't you see that that guy is naturally endowed? Oh, my God. But anybody can make money, Nelly. Any idiot can make money. Any ugly monster can make money. Huh? Ah. Um, you know me now. My pride. Pride. See, we've all got our pride. Let's just pocket it, okay? Look at that guy. I mean, imagine that guy driving out from a posh house. Driving a posh car. In a posh suit. Nelly. I think you're very simple. Oh my god. Mm. Anne. Mm -hmm. You're a genius. You're so blind that you don't see things. Oh god. You're <sighs> scared.
Norma. So this is why you didn't want to go to the hospital? Hmm? Oh, Mama? You think I will not know? What are you talking about? This is why he ran away from the village to the city. Akuya? Mama? What is it? Stop pretending as if you don't know what I'm talking about. Stop pretending! I don't know anything, no, Mama. Hey! Chine to me. Chine to me. No, my dear. You're pregnant. I'm Bamba, Mama. No, my dear. Better stop it, oh. Don't stop it. Papa! Papa! No, my papa! Mama, all I know is that I'm not pregnant. I'm not pregnant. You're pregnant? And your father must hear this. Your father must hear this. You know your father? Nani! Nani! Who knows what I'm going to do? Come on, answer the question and tell him the truth. Stop lying. No, ma, ask again. How many months pregnant are you now? Papa, I am no longer a child. So I should know when I'm pregnant and when I'm not. Papa, throw me, me. I'm not pregnant. Huh? You didn't mean it. Are you telling me the truth? Yes, Papa. I'm not pregnant. Blind. No, ma, it's blind. Papa, since him, Papa, please, oh, I am not pregnant. Biko, I'm not pregnant. Anywhere you want to go, me, I'm ready to go. So, you are sure? I'm sure. Then leave her. Huh? No, I'm ready to go. Leave her alone. Leave her. Leave her. Leave her. Leave her. I know what I do. Hey, nothing in order to go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't say that. Don't say Kill you and kill that bastard. Yeah. How far? She's not pregnant. Huh? She only has malaria and typhoid. Hey, Doctor, I hope you're not deserving me. Why, why would I do that? Thank you. Thank you, Doctor. Welcome. She has one. Come on, stand up, let's go. Let's go! Come. You know I saw my last experience with Charles. I'm happy the way I am. I don't want anything that will cause me happy. I know. I mean, I understand. But you're a woman. You need to settle down. You need a man that will make you happy. You need a man that will love and cherish you. You cannot continue like this. You need to settle down someday. So, 
Why must it be that boy? Why must it be that boy? Nelly, are you blind? Can't you see? There is something about this guy. I mean, if I wasn't engaged, we wouldn't be talking this. I would have taken that guy long ago. I don't, I don't think I'm ready for such games right now. Did you just say games? Wait, wait, wait. Nelly, does this look like a game to you? I mean, you wake up one day and regret this. I mean, you wake up one day and you call me and you tell me you're regretting it. Nelly, if this guy stays up to a month in this town and these other ladies see him and pick him up and touch him up and clean him up. Nelly, what this guy needs is money. Once you are able to give him that money, you have his loyalty and his honesty for life. I don't know why you're doing this, Anne. I mean, you act like you've forgotten about Charles. Do you know what happened? I don't know why you're doing this now. Nelly, can you stop? I mean, can you stop this Charles, 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 Charles thing and move on? Nelly, move on with your life. You are not living. This is not normal. Every time Charles, Charles, move on. Please. You're my friend. I won't deceive you. I want what's best for you. Leave Charles and move on with your life, please. Charles here, yeah, Charles there. Yeah. Move on. Forget that fool. Madam at the bakery that he works, she just came to know where he's staying. What did I tell you about bringing people into my house? Hey, madam, she's not people. She's his madam. She's his boss at the bakery that she just wanted to know where he's staying in case of emergency. I do not want to see that boy in this house by tomorrow morning. Hey, madam, please. Hey, you can... Go and tell him what I said now! I'm very sorry. It will never happen again. Please, ma. If you sack me now, I don't have anywhere to go. I don't know anyone in the city. And I don't want to go back to the village now. Please, ma. But I warned you. I warned you. Don't let anybody into my compound. I told you. I warned you. But please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The woman needed to know that I'm genuine. She, she says she wants to know where I'm living. And if, if I didn't bring her home, she would have terminated my appointment. Please, ma. Please. I'm sorry. It will never happen again. Please. Please, ma. Get up. Thank you, ma. Thank you, ma. How much does she pay you? She said she will start with 30,000 Naira. That's 
I want to quit that job. Ma? Yes. But, Ma, if I... I will pay you 60,000 Naira. Start working for me. Sweep my house, wash my clothes, wash my cars. Just clean my house, inside and outside. It just starts now. Thank you, Ma. Thank you. Chimobi, I think my madam likes you. Why would you say such a thing? How would a big lady like that like me? A pauper like me? Love is blind. Uh, yeah. Can't you see the handwriting on the wall? She likes you. She better not like me because it will not work. Lena, no, no. look at this one. She will, you better pray. Hmm? Pray and fast. You see you better pray that she likes you. Because the mere fact that my mother likes you, you're a millionaire. Not even talk of when she marries you. You see what I'm Mohaliban. What makes you think that me, Chimobi, will accept you, Maria? Yes, you will, Chimobi. Because you need money. You, Chimobi, need money more than any person in this world. Yes. If you want to be identified with our people, Chima, if you want our people to respect you, if you want our people to stop treating you like something or someone picked from a gutter or from a nearby bush, you need money. Serious money. I won't be. Yes. Chima, if you don't have money, you will have address. You will have something. You have money. Norma is looking for who to send to untimely grave. What is it again, this woman? Tell me. Norma is not in this house. Yeah. Immediately I went in, she sneaked out of this house. Excuse me, what did I just hear you say? Norma, I'm about to go. She's nowhere to be found. Hey. She's not in this house. It's okay now, listen to me. Eh? Go now and search for her. Every nook and cranny of this village. And sack it. And bring her home right now. My in-law just called me now and said that I'm already on their way to this place. Hey! You must do this now. Pick it up, man. Pick it up, man. Pick it up, man. at our usual spot. But you're not here. I've... I've waited for you here since morning. When are you coming back? They want to take me away from you. But I will not let them. And I'm going to wait here until you come back and take me with you.
Obim. Welcome, ma'am. I feel the impact of going to give me. And then I beg you all. I miss you. I love you. Not even a thousand suitors can take me away from you. Very handsome. Look, you deserve much more than this low life. I want to make you the man of your dreams. <laughs> Look, you may not know, but I have all it takes to change your life. But all I need from you is faithfulness. Would you always be there for me? Would you make me the woman of my dream? Or will you just diss me as soon as your status improves? Because I know a million women will start fighting over you once you start making money. They may not notice you now that you are a nobody, but <laughs> once you are made, they'll fight over you. Trust me. Chimogi, tell me, would you always be there for me? Today I make a strong promise to you. 
This tree over our head and this stick bear me witness as I make a vow to you that I will never, ever leave you for another woman, no matter what. <laughs> uh, today I also make a strong promise to you, let this tree over our head and this stick be my witness that I will never, ever leave you for another man, no matter the circumstances. <laughs> Oh my god, this is too much for me. This is too much. Please help me, Lord. Please. Please help me. Tomorrow, be. Hmm? Eh? What kind of sleep is this? Mando, you won't understand at all. What time is it? Um, Chimobi. Um, I think you have to go to the village this morning. What's the problem? Yeah. What's the problem? Calm down now. What's your mind? Calm down. Are you not a man? Take it easy. Okay. Okay. Yay. I'm calm. I'm calm. So what is the problem? Uh, I received a call this morning from the village. Uh -huh. uh, so they said that uh, your mother had a small attack and was taken to the hospital. Oh. Uh, just small. Oh. She's in the hospital. Oh, Bano. Hey, Chimo. Hey, Chim. Ma, I warned her. I warned Mama, but she would not listen. Ma. Oh! Uh, what are you doing? Where are you going to? What kind of stupid question is that now, Madu? But must you pack everything? Eh? Chimomi? Yes, I will pack everything. Because I'm not coming back here. I'm going to stay with Mama no matter what. I will come back here not even for all the wealth in the world. Uh, Chima, at least you, you, you will take your bath now. Eh? Uh, Biasa, uh, Hon. Have a maka. Have a Not to kill any shop. Timothy. Timothy, I told you. I told you never to allow that woman to go back to her level again. I told you. Doctor, doctor, I tried my best. She insisted that I should go to the town. She said that I should go to the city and live, but that she would survive without me. She's the one that insisted. And you believe that? Doctor, you don't understand. I insisted and insisted, but the woman was living like her life depended on it. And I had to go. Doctor. Doctor, please. Her case is too complex now. Too complex. She didn't give me. Nobody knows whether she will survive. Doctor Umbani. No. I doubt it. No, Doctor, no. I doubt it because from the series of tests we ran on her, it was obvious that her second kidney has been affected also. needs to be placed on a constant dialysis until a suitable donor is found at the kidney transplanted. And thirdly, if these things are not done as fast as possible, chances are that she might not survive the coma. If she eventually does, she will not live longer than three months. Doctor, take my kidney. Take my kidney. Just Test me and take one of my kidneys and go for her. It's anything it takes. Doctor, please. Kidney transplant costs a lot of money. Besides, it is not done in the local village hospital. It is done in the modern hospital with ultra modern facilities. How much? John. Nobody knows how many times she has to go to dialysis. But the kidney transplant alone will cost nothing less than three to four million naira.
Mama, it's me. It's me, Baba. 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 Baba, because Baba, because yeah. Baba, because <laughs> it's okay. Stop crying. Your mother will be fine. Okay, she'll be fine. She'll not show Yes, I. I, I am. I'm sure. It's okay. Is there no way you can miss this money? How can I raise three million naira? How? Maybe you can meet your mother's brothers. You know, cause. They can sell one or two pieces of land and then waste the money for her. Even if I left the doctor's office, I rushed to see them. And instead of them to help, they were busy worsening the case by reminding me of my mother's plight. It's okay. Don't mind. Eh? God should send help soon. He better send help. God should better send help. Because if my mother dies, I will die with her. I swear I will. No. Don't talk like that. Don't talk like that. Nobody will die. It was Robert with Kemo. I cannot live one minute without my mother. Okay. Is there nobody in the city that you can run to for help? Which city? The one I went to a few days ago. Uh -huh. See, I'm just worried and I'm just looking for a way to help. What do you mean by that? Your mother needs to leave. And you have someone in the city that can help you. And you are saying you don't want to go. Why? Because of you. Huh? Mom. Hey. How? I don't understand. Change your clothes. Then let's go. Vico, 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 let's go. I want to stay with my mother. Mm. Mm. You don't want to stay with me, Opia. You don't love me anymore, Opia. Okay. I never said that. Eh, so let's go now. Eh? See, you staying here will not change anything. No? It will not add or subtract to your mother's condition. So why don't we just go home so that you can have your bath, change your clothes, eat and have energy. Then rest small. You will now come back here again and stay with her. You go. Thank you. 
Madam. I haven't seen Chimobi since I got back. Uh, Madam, Chimobi is in hot soup. Bro. Hot soup. Hot soup? Uh, uh, his mother is very sick. In fact, as I'm talking to you now, the woman is in a coma. And they don't they need to give her a kidney transplant. And they need over four million naira for that. Oh my god. Uh, in fact, as the boy is just awaiting the mother's death. In fact, I don't know where you get that kind of money from. Jesus Christ. Where is he now? The village he traveled this morning. This is not good news at all. It's not though, uh, madam, it's not. I told you, eh? If my madam does not like people coming to this crowd. You want to put me in trouble? Eh? Oh, oh he's, my madam is back now. I told you, I told you, you want to put me in trouble. I'm here to see Chimobi. He has not been to work for some days now. Listen, I do not want to see you anywhere around this house again. Are we quarreling? <laughs> oh, is that how you go about looking for your staff everywhere? Listen, you will not like what I will do to you if I see you here again. It's not an offense for me to ask for my staff. Are you still here? Get a steal of my clothes and drive to my compound. Rubbish! Eat now. Hmm? Yeah, no, no, you've not even eaten anything. No, I'm not hungry. Ah, ah, my cousin is a panel. And now, hmm? No, come. I'm food in bag. We me you through king head. You're gonna go, but all this are for gonna go. Okay, madam. Eat now. Why are you acting as if this doesn't affect you? I'm not the only one in trouble here. I know. You don't know anything, Nina. You don't. Look, if my mother dies now, I swear, I swear, I will die with her. I will close my eyes and I will die. Then you will decide whether you will join us or you survive without I'll us. Stop talking like that. Nobody is going to die, Biko. Eh? See, nothing will happen to your mother. Nothing will happen to you. And nothing will happen to us. Where is your fate? Eh? I pray so. I hope so. Even if it's money, it eat. I spent my time cooking this food for you. Eat meat. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Who are they? Madhu. Yeah? You, uh, you brought them to the village. Yes, now. Nah. You don't like that. <laughs> no, no, it's not, it's not that I don't like it. It's, uh, it's just that I wasn't expecting to see you people. Well, Madhu told me everything. And you don't expect me to sit down and watch your life depreciate when I can actually help. I have come to help. Who is she? Uh, oh. Um... Ne, no ma. This is Nelly, my friend. Uh, Nelly, uh, this is Norma, my sister. Hi, um, Chimobi, we have to go to the hospital right now. I have to get your mother to Abuja, put her in a very good hospital, and then we'll wait for our documents to be ready, and then we'll fly her to India for her transplant. Come on, we have to go. There's no time. I'm coming, let me, what, what, let me bring... Ah, oh, Chimobi, forget those rags. Come on, we'll get new clothes in Abuja, let's go. No, no. Come on, let's go, there's no time, okay? Let's come, 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 let's go. Come on, guys. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs> Come 
Have you forsaken me? Why? Did I not try? Did I not try enough for you? How could you have forgotten so soon all I went through because of you? How I suffered because of you? The sacrifices I made for you and your mother. <sighs> Let heavens be my witness. <gasps> Let them judge us. <laughs> Let them judge us. Yes, they left yesterday. In fact, you had the airport here already. Taxi is bringing them home. That's Taxi nice. Ah, <laughs> oh, God. It's been so long. Six long months. I can't wait to see him. No wonder that you're smiling. Ah, <laughs> oh, I will be forever grateful to you, my friend. It was your idea in the first place. And today, I'm so, so happy. <laughs> When I was telling you, oh, <laughs> oh, oh my world! <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 
Surprises. I have a big one for you. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to see what this big surprise of yours is. <laughs> Jimmy, thank you, God. Thank you for giving my son this lovely lady. <laughs> Mama, and thank you for giving birth to this lovely boy. Hey! I am some son. Okay, stop. Seriously, both of you stop. <laughs> Steals one of your chicken. No! no Eat mama's food. No, no. Chicken is the best, <laughs> that is how he cheats me all the time. <laughs> Mommy's boy. Mm -hmm. Now I'm now I'm Nelly's boy. Oh no, 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 Yes, so those uh, documents and the bank book letter I was sending to you while you were in India were actually for both the contract and the new company. Wait, you got a federal government contract in my name? <laughs> and I'm already executing it on your behalf. It's actually over a billion naira. What? Yes, baby. And the only thing left for me to do now is take you to your new office where you meet your general manager and your auditor general. They will let you know how far the project has gone. <laughs> Nelly, you're, you're kidding me, right? I'm not, baby. I told you. You deserve much more. Uh, I met with your site manager today and he said your company has already been registered and is also already on a federal government project. <laughs> so, what you're trying to say is that I'm now a contractor? A big time contractor, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, <laughs> the house is beautiful. Oh, give it. Hey, <laughs> Mama, I'm glad you like it. I like it, though. Nick, give it everywhere. I like it. Nice present. I for me, I for me, I'm gonna. Again, you know, Efe, we um, give us a few minutes. We have something to discuss. Ah. Okay, so what do you know? I chop up my name, my guy. Mama. Shakara Bobo. Let me go outside and look around some more. If I can't tell you. Now, first things first. I think you need to start building. I saw uh, Mazianya and he said um, he can sell some plots of his land to us. Once you pay, then you start building a big, beautiful, <laughs> massive house. I'm not ready to go to the village, Mama. Oh, what are Why? You have to go to the village. You need to go to the village so that they can see that you have made it. You have become a big man. That way, they will start identifying you. Who do you think would follow you to go and pay a dowry when Nelly proposes to you? You're talking as if you don't know I'm, as, uh, I'm in a fix right now. In a, what kind of fix? I want to know. 
Why would you ask me such a question? Oh, is it a normal? Yeah. That one is not a problem. No. Have you forgotten that Norma's father said that you cannot marry her? That he will kill you, Ilosogo? Nah, we don't need a Norma anymore. No, 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 Mama. Mbakwa, I will not be a party to that. I will not. Eh. Yeah. Okay, Chelo. So now you want to disappoint this nice girl that has been there for you. A girl that saved my life. She gave me back my life. Oh. Turned you into a big man. Eh? Got uh, uh, contracts for you from the government. Now you want to disappoint her. Mama, the same way Norma suffered for us. Norma suffered for us. Have you forgotten so soon? Norma sacrificed for us. Forgive me for the sacrifice of what that Norma did. What are we talking about? Eh? I don't even want to think about it because I am sure she is married. I mean, she had a lot of suitors coming her way. Some came by car, some on their bikes. Mandy Joko Webia. I'm sure mm. she's long settled down by now. Mbam, no way, Mama. Norma will marry only me. Akoko, in Amako, right from when you were a child, Norma will marry only you. I'm sure by now Norma has her own family. So why don't you go for her? She will wait for me now. She will wait. She will wait for He's not building a house. Hmm. <laughs> ah, ah. They said he is now a minomia since he came back from Obodo Ibo. Mm -hmm. This life eh, is something else. My sister, everybody in this village is now running around Ekiro. Mama Chimobi, even the uncles and the brothers that abandoned them then is now showing a lot of concern. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Because she now drives a big jeep. Now. She has a driver. She has a driver now. Are you not in this village? Yeah. Oh, the woman has really suffered. Ah, who doesn't know her story in this village? Hey. Hmm. My major concern is Norma. That girl has rejected a lot of suitors, all in the name of waiting for Chiwubi. I pray he marries her. Hmm. That one is your concern. Me, I'm happy. That God has finally given bad in King. Let that be my That's my own. Because it's not easy. This one. Yeah? Oh, oh, oh. Ah, Uncle? I'm fine, Mama. Nani, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, Ada. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, sir. What about our son, Chimobi? Chimobi, yeah. eh. he's in Abuja. Hey, um, and I learned you sleep in a hotel at uh, where each time you come back. Uh, nanny, as you put it, true. I'll fuck with him. 
It's true. Mm, but I, I, that, that, uh, that house belongs to your father. And nobody is pushing you and your son away from that house. It's better you take a, a room there uh, than wasting money unnecessary in the hotel. It's not good, Ada. It's okay, Nani. I feel comfortable staying in the hotel. So, Boadiro. Well, if you say so. Mm. Okay, uh, if you get back to Abuja, uh, tell our son, Chim, Obi, that uh, just tell him to make time to visit you. That I have a very crucial uh, matter to discuss with him. Huh? Mm -hmm. Nah, so bad, you know. I will let him know. I was already on my way. Hey, out. okay, let me be my on uh, my way too. Uh, 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 hey. I really thank God for the work. The work is going on. Okay. Yeah. Uh, good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? Mama. No, Mama. <laughs> hey. Now, why are you with someone? I rob with someone in the village. You're looking well. Hey, Mama. How are you? <laughs> Mama, I'm fine. No, I am fine. Yeah, but it's just I've not seen Chimobi since he came back from Obudu Ibo. Hey, Mama. I'm just wondering why he hasn't taken out small time to come and see me. Eh? Or is he fair? Nem, Odiro man, please forgive him. It's just that Chimobi is a very busy man. Imakwa, eh? He sits with the president and ministers and I'm a business. Even when he's with them and you call him, oh, will you fall on your president? I'm telling you. <laughs> He's not a big man, no. He is, so. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he is. But, Mama, is he so busy that he cannot at least leave that president small and talk to me? How come I'm normal? Eh? Normal, Mom. If you could be so good. But let me tell you the truth because I wouldn't want to lie to you. You got to go keep eagerly on your head. Chimobi doesn't even think of you anymore. Eh, Zioku. All the two busy. Contracts, eba and eba. Oh, when you find out what? Lifting oil. Yeah! I got up on me all on man, man, I got business and a mechanical. You got a go one name, so be cookie by a low. Hey, I'm a wrong one, you know. Come on, one eye, Chimobi should be the one telling you. Man, I can't wily. For what Chimobi is about to, uh, I'm sure Chimobi is married. Only go on, I'm about to see about her name. Mamma, if he. Mama, what did you say? Hey, because I'm up now. Ask Mama, what did you say? I'm up I said I, I, I shouldn't be the one to tell you. Man, I can't just leave you. Hey, Why are you What papa you Oh. I Get driver. Where is that driver? Chimobi, we promised not to leave each other, no matter the circumstances. I sacrificed everything. Chimobi, I went through hell. I went through fire just because of this love. I sacrificed everything. The only thing I did not sacrifice was my life. 
but now. You have taken away that life from me. You have killed me. Jimobi, you have killed me. the marriage. Eh? You know what she did? She ended up disgracing herself and not me. Why? Because she's waiting for that good for nothing bastard of no reputation. Now the boy has made money in the city and he has abandoned her to rot her. Nonsense. If we say her in the kudiko, stop saying that. Stop saying it. If anything has happened to her, this is what you've been saying. Akwea? Mature the game What else do you expect me to say? Kill your uncle. Nah, no, no. Where is your lover boy? Oh, look at the woman. Where is the boy? Where is he? Nonsense. You are crying. Huh? <laughs> Stop saying that to her, please. Stop saying that to her. Crying is not the answer. Is it the answer? Where is your lover boy? And you are crying. It's okay, it's me. This is just the beginning, no? You have not started crying. No, thank you, bro. Oh, no, 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 no,
Nonsense. If a child says his mother will not sleep, please. I said, what did you tell I her? I did not tell her anything. You're lying to me? Huh? You're lying to me? What did you tell her? Uh, um, wait, let me remember. What did I tell Okay. Uh, now, I, I told her that you're married. What? Uh, you did what? I, I, I told her you're married so she would leave you to concentrate on your new life. Your new girl, your new home and your new job. And why did you in here? Do you know the consequences of what you have done? Do you? You lied to an innocent girl because of money. Who told you have a newfound love? Who told you? Who? Chilobi. What's going on here? Eh? What's going on here? I don't know. I don't, this is not Chimobi. This is not my son. This here is a monster. You're trying me. Honey, what is it? Why is she shouting at Mama? Mama, eh? what's happening? Leave me. Leave me. I don't want to be left alone. Mm. I have to take Leave him more. Because of Mama, you're, you're harassing me. And I want to go back there, so I will, I'll be suffering. It's me, Mom. Nonsense. Go, maybe see everything. Said to go. Say nothing. Okay, why did you shut up your mother? Look, it's just a it's just a minor family misunderstanding. Nothing more. Family misunderstanding? <sighs> Baby, what am I to you? Am I not family to you? Am I a stranger to you now? I never said that. So why are you keeping this away from me? Talk to me, baby. Talk to me. There's nothing to talk about. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Just trust me. Suddenly changed. It seems doesn't want to be with me anymore. Every little thing I do now irritates him. He just flips at me over every little issue. Why is this happening? You know, I never wanted to give my heart to anyone. You understand what happened to me with Charles? And you lured me into this. Now I'm in love with him and the whole thing is affecting me seriously. It is. Are you sure he's not seeing somebody else? He's not. Are you sure? I have my eyes on him. Damn it. All his staff are my people. Yeah. I planted them there to monitor his every move. His cooks, his drivers, his security man, they are all my people. I mean, come on now. <laughs> he didn't expect me to play loose with him. Not after my experience with Charles. Yeah. Why the change? I mean, why is he behaving like this now? 
I don't know. Seems more like a spiritual problem to me. Hmm? Spiritual. Sort of. That's serious. Are you serious? Continue like this. I mean, I'm human and we make mistakes. I'm not perfect. I've really come to love you so much, so much, like never before. I've built my world around you and I don't think I can ever live without you. <laughs> I can't. Baby. If it's something you don't like about me, just say it. Just say it and I'll change. doesn't rot your tears at all. Why do you tears are less good? I love him. I love him so much. And I don't think I will ever live without him, Mama. You can live without him. I say, I say. You can live without him. It's just a matter of time. Time, they say, is the greatest healer. With time, you forget about him and you move on with your life. I don't think it will be possible. It's possible. It's not possible, Mama. It's not possible. Nagira, it's not possible. 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 Because if Janya, let's go inside. Let's go. Mama, I don't want to go to bed yet. I want to stay here. Mama, I don't want to go to bed yet. I want to stay here. Let's go inside. 
It's okay. You will forget about him soon and move on with your life. Don't you watch your tears. Yes. Uh, who are they looking for? Uh, please, we are looking for Chimobi's house. I hope uh, this is his house. Yes, Naya. Oh, thank God. Oh. <laughs> we are his brothers. Yes. Just tell him that uh, his uncles are here to see him. Uh, okay, I'm coming. Uh, uh, please, uh, tell him is his uncle, Ekene, uh, and uh, his mother's uncle, uh, Ichendo. <laughs> How this old man? Don't be waiting for you to tell me, no, no, no. Now I won't repeat it again. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Uh, you say, no, now come inside. Uh, also, no, no carry anything inside this bag. Uh, no, uh, <laughs> only my snuff and my small bag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, our daughter. The reason why we are here is to address an issue. Uh, something came up recently. Yes. Mm. And what is this issue that came up? About uh, Chimbo's uh, fatality. How? Why, what, what are you talking about? Uh, please, sister. Tell us the truth. Who is the father of Shimobi? Uh, I mean, why are we talking about this? What is the reason for this? The reason is that your cousin, your mother's elder brother's son, Obiadu, came to our place with some of his kinsmen, claiming that uh, he is a Shimobi's uh, father. That they have come to perform the cleansing rituals so that they will have him back. Are there many and many? What? What are you talking about? Sister. Uh, is it true? Mama. Please, sister, tell us the truth. Who is Chimobi's father? Inky baby. What? Inky, do you know you're a very beautiful girl? Eh? Uh -huh. How come you're just noticing it now? I've been staying in my maternal home for the past two weeks and you're just noticing it. See, you're just the both of us alone. Let's go inside and have fun. Let's do it. Go inside and do it. Are you out of your mind? Huh? What is wrong with you? You want us to go inside and commit Ibene? Yes, now. You don't know it's a taboo for me and you to have an affair. Which taboo? <laughs> Nobody will know now. Nah. It's just both of us. Obi, take your time, oh. Take your time. I am not interested. Now get out. Cut off. Find yourself. You must do this thing, oh. Obi. You must do it. And today. I am only you, oh. I am only you, Obi. Stay from me. Nikki, Nikki, now. You must oh, do this. Obi. <laughs> okay. Tell grandmother what you did to me. I will tell her. Let her come back. She said, I'm very sorry. It was the hand of the devil. I don't know what came over me. Please. So, so, so when I was telling you to leave me alone, why didn't you leave me alone? Why? Okay. Please. Okay. I'll stop crying now, okay? Stop crying. Mama will soon come. Let her Please. come back. I will tell her for you. You will tell her? Yes. Oh. So you want them to stone me to death, Abby? You want them to kill me? Okay. You can go ahead. Go ahead and tell her. Is he not dead? I will just die now. 
So, so who is talking about that here? Who is really talking about that here? You don't know that if you tell anyone what to do, it's a taboo. And the consequences are the person involved will be taken to the market square and stoned to death. Hey! Oh, yes. Yes. Ask anybody. It's a taboo for close relations to have sex in our village. Don't you know? The person will be stoned to death because the person doesn't to be an evil child. So, 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 so why you know it's the taboo? Why, why, did you, why did you stop doing it? That is why I told you that it was the devil's handwork. I'm sorry, it won't happen again. Please, forgive me now. I'm sorry now. For the past two months, it's like I'm pregnant. Is this a kind of joke? You know, this is not something to joke about, okay? Who is joking with you here? And I'm, I'm telling you, I'm pregnant, and you, you, you're, you're calling it a joke. Hey, hey. I'm not joking, I'm pregnant. Hey. Hey, okay. What is it? We are finished. Thank you. We are dead. Why are you talking like that? Is this how we end up our lives? Huh? Maybe you are doing that. I told you. I told you. you. See, you want to know that if this pregnancy shows up now and you tell people that I, your cousin, is, is responsible for it, don't you know that the both of us will be taken to the village square and stoned to death? Don't you know? to impregnate his cousin. See, the best thing for me to do now is to keep this pregnancy secret. If not, the both of us will be taken to the village square and stoned to death. Don't you know? So who would I tell my family? Is it every question that you answer? See, the only thing we will do now is to keep this thing secret between the both of us and not allow anyone to hear it. Or do you want to die? Good for it. Fine. Since you don't want to die, then let's keep this secret between the both of us, okay? Hey! You want to kill her? Get out of my way. Let me kill her. Let me kill her, Ndokako. This girl is so hard-hearted. Can you imagine? Since morning, I've been asking her to tell me who got her pregnant. Wait for email. But she won't tell me. Eh? I want me to clap for her. I will kill her, I will kill her today. Tell your father who got you pregnant. Eh? He has been beating you since you came back. Tell him who got you pregnant so he will stop beating you. See? You should leave her home. You should put the bed. And what? I don't want this to happen. Please tell me. Put what the bed? Him. <coughs> Megan. Eh? Oh! Papa! 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 Oh, it's okay. Oh. It's okay. Over my dead body, will she put it to the bed in this house? <coughs> Advise her to take cause to that man who got her pregnant. So that we will force that man to marry her. That will be the best, the only option. Or, this house will not be able to put the bed. I'm going to take Sister, so this is true. Who be deceived and defied you? Whether it is true or not, it makes no difference. She will be here is true, son. Because uh, they did not bear her back. We cannot fold our hands and the world they collect our illustrious son from us. Are they men and men like that? What exactly makes you think I would like to be identified with you people? Ah uh ah. -huh. Nkiru here is uh, my brother's uh, daughter. And you are our son. Alright. Right. Look at you. 
So because I've made money, I am now your illustrious son. Right? Hmm? Zanum. Have you forgotten so soon how you made this woman right here suffer unnecessarily? Have you? Have you forgotten how you denied us a portion of land? You. And you again. When we needed to ease our burden through famine. Now you walk in here. And you want to come and reap where you did not sow. Shameless men. Nana Wiley. Chimobi, please don't be angry with us. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you see, don't want to see anything. As a matter of fact, the only thing I want to see right now is both of you leaving my house. Chimobi, huh? it hasn't got to do it. has got to it. It has. Now, Udo. Akene, get out of my house. Or else I will get you arrested and jailed. I understand how you feel about my uncle and my brother. But because one, forgive them. Forgive them so that you can get the most important thing that you need in life. Which is? Identity. Identity. Look at them. They are not ready to accept you as one of theirs. Eh? Let bygones be bygones so that we can move on. You will have people to call your own kinsmen. Anything that happens, you know where to go to. You know where you belong. I understand what you're trying to say. But what stops me from going with my own real kinsmen? My father's people. It is a taboo. Mama, they said they are ready to perform the cleansing rituals. I'd rather stick with my own people than your own people that left you to the point of death, abandoned you. And now they surface from nowhere because, because God has smiled on us. Nah. Look, Mama. what I'm trying... Mama, this is my decision on this issue. And it is final. Missing me. We were together last night. Yeah, like that's ever enough. <laughs> anyway, for today, I want to take your baby out to lunch. And that's all you want? Yes, that's all I want. Mm, okay. Break time, lunch time. Lunch time, yay! <laughs> that's my baby. Yeah. Uh, okay. Right, Where are we going? Mm, that'll be a secret. Ah. <laughs> hey, how's my There's something I'd like to discuss with you. Look. And people are getting worried. I told you about my last experience with my ex. Hey, who may come in to see my people? I mean, when are we going to make this thing official? I mean, did I say something? Did I say something wrong? No, no. 
So why are you not happy? Look, it's it's not I'm, it's not that I'm not happy per se. It's just it's just that I'm thinking. I'm I'm, I'm thinking <sighs> this is not the time, and um, maybe you're being too fast, too forward. I'm not, babe. We've been dating for over nine months now. Besides, my people are worried. They wouldn't want me to go through what I did with my ex. It's okay. I um. Uh, it's alright. Let's eat. Okay, let's not. Uh, this is not the time to discuss this. We'll talk about it later. But I'll be the one to bring it up. Not you. Okay? Baby, I'm sorry. It's not like I don't trust you or that I feel insecure with you. It's just. I want to be with you all the time. I want to call your wife. Let's eat. Problem, honey. Talk to me. to my place in the village. 
Okay, what about her? She's not my sister. Who is she then? She's the girl I love. My soulmate. What's the meaning of this madness? Baby, I have to tell you the truth right now. Because we can't build this thing on a lie. If we do, it will it will fail you and it will fail me in the end. And what is the truth? The truth is, I love this girl, and she loves me too. We, we made a promise. We made a promise to each other not to leave each other, no matter what. Look, I never knew I was going to see you again. I never planned to see you again. But you came looking for me in the village. You gave me hope. You gave me a reason to live. But now, my past is haunting me. My conscience pricks me. I feel like I've betrayed this girl. I can give you back everything, everything you ever gave me. As long as you give me peace of mind, because that's the only thing that is important to me right now. Baby, I've come to love you too. I've come to love you too, so much. But I can't stay with you, because I won't be happy. Can't you see? I won't forgive myself. You won't be happy. We won't be happy in this marriage. Why would you want to stay with a man whose body has opened so why would you want to stay with a man who, no matter what you do, no matter how hard you try, you can never make him happy? No! I really don't know, but I know every disappointment is a blessing in disguise. And I know fate has so much in stock for you. Chimobi is a good guy. You went to him. He didn't come to you. I was the one who pushed you, I know. Fine. But I mean, okay, look at it this way. You were meant to save his mother's life and change his destiny. <laughs> so, what did I gain by doing all that? You saved a life. I mean, you put a smile on somebody's face. You are a world changer. You changed this world. Someone will not try to put a smile on my own face. <laughs> Someone will put a smile on your face soon. I know that because you deserve it. Believe me, Kay. I would have loved to just reduce to the power that he was before I picked him up. <laughs> I didn't feel what I'm feeling now. Does he deserve that? He's not a gold digger. She didn't break your heart. He's just a product of destiny. Stop, stop, stop. 
about the consequences of your action? What is going to happen after everything? What will happen? What? Look, I'll call Nelly and I'll personally hand over everything back to her. Her company documents, her house keys, her car keys, every single thing. But what about the house in the village? <laughs> if she wants that one, I'll give it back to her too. What, what will it profit me to have all those things, all the good things of life and never have any No happiness, no peace of mind. No, no. Doesn't make any sense. Norma is the source of my true joy. What about her father? Norma, the same way that you cannot stop me from marrying the one that I want to marry, that's the same way that neither her father nor anyone else can stop her from marrying who she wants to marry. Me. What makes you think Norma would be there waiting for you? After all that I told her. No. She won't. She'll wait for me. And what makes you too sure of yourself? I am. She belongs to me. And I belong to her. Blind them to their heartless ways. Forgetting that one day they'll pay. Wait. Our elders cannot come from nowhere and start to reap from here they have not sown. Oh. From beginning of the pregnancy till when the baby was born, they were nowhere. If what? Even during the raising of the baby, they were not found. <laughs> so how could they now come from nowhere and start to lay claim to the boy? Are they me? Oh. And you're happy so many and maybe so many. Oh no what? And me me. He has no right over that boy. Because he did not pay the bride price of the mother. He did not even perform the cleansing rituals that would have qualified him to have the boy. Oh. So how can he just come and start laying claim over the boy? In fact, he's just a joker. She more peace than our son. Nobody will take him away from us. Nobody! And I'm even the Yeah. He's going to no place. I, I mean it. Uh, but he changed. That's problem. Which What's problem? the problem? See, the boy himself refused to identify with us. So what are we going to do? Are we going to force him to identify with us? Or what do we do? That's my problem. Just forget about those displays of this. You see, uh, last time you and I visited this place in the city, the little boy was trying to, to express his anger. You know what happened? He threatened to lock us up with police. Eh? He, he, he even chased us out of his house. Remember that he's still smoking. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so he's going to no place. He belongs to us. That's it. Eh? What? Is it us? What? Can't you take a message? Amen. Are you not going to work today? Which work? Okay. Mommy, I'm just, I'm just waiting for the appropriate time to go back to Nelly, thank her for all she has done for us, and give everything back to her. Don't tell me that kind of story. So just get ready because we're going to leave this house and leave everything for her. I'm going back to the woman I love. Yes, you can do a channel but story, story, story. You're going back to where? Come and carry me to the village. No one say now. Don't go, okay? Just stay. Stay here. Oh. Let the owner of the house come and push you out by herself. She can't do anything. I'm not going back. Don't even say that kind of rubbish. Instead of you to go to Nelly, 
Hey guy, your nyaka won't get here, your wine. And then you people will start planning for your wedding. And you will move way on. You know, I'm not going to call you. Well, Iban. If you love her so much, then go and marry her yourself. I will marry her for you. I will marry her and I will drug you and you will get her pregnant. Nelly, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry for all the pain that I've caused you. It wasn't intentional, believe me, it wasn't. I'm so sorry. I, I never meant to hurt you. Never. Believe me. I was in a tight fix and everything I did, I did for you. Believe it or not, everything I did, I did for you. It was better I told you the truth. Rather than lie to you and you find out from somewhere else later on. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Please, please forgive me. Please, please, I'm so, so sorry. I appreciate everything you did for my mother and I, everything you've done for us, and I'll be forever indebted to you. I'm here to return everything. Everything. The cars, the house, the company, everything. As long as it will make you happy. is that? Well, you know, we lost some contacts. And I've been in the UK all this while. I've been in jail. I just came back to Nigeria two weeks ago and I asked after you. And they said you made fire tree. <laughs> well, I hope you are not just trying to put off a show with all this. No, 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 no. Let's just go inside, have some drinks, eat, then we'll talk more. I've been praying for God for a day like this. Come on. Come on. Come on, baby. How could you, Charles? How could you do this to me after everything I did for you? You told me you were only going to the UK to upgrade your skills, only for you to get there, not even a phone call. He just made me a laughing stock before my family and my friends. Baby, believe me. It wasn't my fault. I love you and I will always do. Baby, you know, I can never plan of leaving you. It was the fault of the UK police. What about them? You know, they had my picture. Someone gave them an information that was coming in. So when I stopped my foot on the airport, I was apprehended. I was stripped from everything I was having, straight to the chair. Why would they do a thing like that? Um, apparently we had some issues, and I thought everything has been settled. But when I came into the airport, I was caught. But thank God, I finished serving my three years jail time, and I'm a free man.
So you mean you were still thinking about me all those years? For real. Every morning I woke up in the jail. I just made a certain prayer. I said, Father Lord, I commit my pretty damsel Nelly into your hands. Keep her away from men and deceivers. You know? So to cut the long story short, when I made it outside, I looked into your fingers and I wasn't seeing any ring. And I thank God that my prayers has been answered. So what makes you think I'm not into any relationship now? Well, I'm here right now. I'm the rightful owner. Every other person was a thief. So when once the rightful owner is here, every thief goes hiding. Charles, <laughs> you haven't changed at all. Wow. I skipped my marriage. When are we getting married? So fast? Yeah, you don't know what it means. All these three whole years without you. It takes only God for someone to survive. No hug, no kisses, no cuddling, mm -hmm. nothing, nothing. <laughs> um, I'm confused here. Okay. Baba, I am not lying. I'm not lying. She told me to take everything and leave nothing for her. Is it, I'm serious. This girl is an angel. Oh, angel. Gabriel called Gabriela. Hey! Wow, Mama I mean, I couldn't even believe my ears when she said it to me. She said, Chima, take everything. Take everything. Leave nothing for me. Leave nothing! <laughs> hey! To you be all thanks and honor. Now forget. Now you are free to marry your norm. Um, about that, when I'm actually thinking in a in a different direction. Direction what? Give me an Okay, check this. How much does this girl love me, or how could she love me so much that she sacrificed everything for me? Everything, including her happiness. Easy. It's unbelievable. Uh -huh. So, okay, features. Are you not the one that told me that you and Norma are meant for each other? Mama. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> The reason I brought you out here is to have a one-on-one -on -one with you before going to see Uncle Bungu. Okay. Um, I'm sorry about what happened the other day. I'm sorry about the way I overreacted. I know I overreacted, but it's because of uh, the anger and depression from all that I've been through. I'm sure you understand. <laughs> no, my son, you don't have to do that. Eh? You don't have to apologize to us. We are the ones that should apologize to you. Huh? In fact, we really treated you and your mother bad. You know? So I want you to find a place in your heart and forgive us. Um, whatever we did was in ignorance. Uh, one more thing. I, I want you to know that this is your rightful home. So you are welcome home, my son. It is well. Thank you. Thank you very much. Sir. And uh, I'm getting married. Oh, congratulations <laughs> in advance. Yeah, I want you to go to the piano. Ah, once again, you are welcome, my in laws. Thank you. <laughs> you see, I am very happy today. Yeah, we are so happy. This is because what was destined to be has finally come to be. <laughs> After all trials and oppositions, my daughter, my beloved daughter, Nemoma, has now decided to. Marry Nelson. Adam. Hey, Adam. 
Ado budo beke. Nine, please. Mm -hmm. Um, I've heard what you say, but um, I like to hear it from her mouth. Oh. I want her to say it. Okay. Ne. I want to ask you. Have you agreed to marry me? Thank you. 